The lower Mississippi River Basin is an important region that stretches from the boot heel of Missouri, going south to include Mississippi, Arkansas, and Louisiana. This region drains as much as 42% of the continental United States water, eventually flowing to the Gulf of Mexico. The landscape in this region consists of an extensive low and flat alluvial plain that's dominated by agriculture. Row crop agriculture is the major form of agriculture in this region and includes soybean, corn, rice, and cotton crops. These crops require extensive irrigation, which is reducing the supplies of groundwater. Growers and scientists have been looking at several ways to reduce irrigation water use for row crops. Some of the management options include conservation farming, such as reducing tillage or using cover crops. Scientists are looking at ways to improve irrigation efficiency, such as studying ways to use less water or optimize the time of application. Another strategy used is storing water in reservoirs for later use. These management strategies help, but the farming community needs other options to save our water resources. One of these technologies is called managed aquifer recharge. Managed aquifer recharge is a way to take surface water and redirect it down into the aquifer for later use. Water is first drawn from a surface water supply, such as a river, then filtered naturally through the ground before it's then pumped into the aquifer. While it's not a new technology by itself, ARS is pioneering a study to determine if it could be used on a larger scale in the Mississippi River Valley Basin. You can learn more about this innovative research and other research by visiting telus.ars.usda.gov.